there will always be, be that pressure out there from people's expectations, being um, my kind of teeny son. But for me, it's not to mind that personally and take that personally and be able to just shut it down. The blurry memories were holding a cricket bat and ball in Sydney, playing around with it, uh, playing in hotel corridors with the players and stuff. So that's how I kind of got the grasp of the game and started developing it from there. Well, obviously having a creating legend in the same roof um, is pretty nice because you don't have to go far t to seek advice. Um, he has played a massive role in my cricket development in terms of the information he's given me, the support he's given me. The nice part is I wasn't forced to told to play cricket. I've chosen it by myself as I played all sports at school, but cricket was my first love. And yeah, I just took it on from there. Um, the team vibe is spot on. We've played recent series versus England and the West Indies. So I've really grown as a player from just being able to take part in those two series as most of those players have played professional cricket. Jokes, music, laughter, being able to keep the guy smiling through the tough times is pretty much my biggest responsibility. And I think for me, it is just to be able to be myself and my personality will express itself naturally. I think South African conditions and New Zealand conditions aren't too different. Um, the overhead suits the bowlers, the ball will move a bit. Um, the wickets are a tad slow, um, same as back home. So for us to adjust, it wasn't too hard. Biggest thing I'm looking forward to at the Island World Cup is playing the big teams, is being able to take part and play against the best players in the world, growing as a cricketer and being able to make brand new friends, new experiences and new memories. It's a massive achievement. It's long hours of hard work, blood, shed and tears. Um, it's been a 17 year journey, being able to represent and be able to say that I have carried on the legacy of my father as well. And being able to put my, my, my brand of cricket out there as Tanuntini and not being put under my father's shadow. So for me, it, it is really nice to have worked for it and being able to be branded with the South African protein on my, on my chest.